This video is sponsored by Ridge Wallet. Want to make your own sleek, minimalist wallet? Make a plane. Extrude. Edge loop. Loop, loop, loop. Finger a thumb hole. Duplicate. Screw it. Bzz. Make a wad of Canadian Monopoly money. Get 12 credit cards. Stuff them in. Now take your fat old wallet along with your 2020 vacation plans and throw them into the trash. Add a strap. Steal a carbon fiber texture. Slap it on and blam! That's how you make a 3D modeled minimalist wallet. Or you can just get one 10% off with free shipping at ridge.com slash 3dpg. You know, whatever floats your boat. What? Uh, I, I don't know, I just expected you to- World of Gumball, it's been on my to-do list forever. I chose this video because I love the show and because my free time is being devoured by an eight-month-old baby and I need to model out something that I could shit out in one day. Yeah, okay, let's model this cat. Open up ZBrush, start with a sphere that has a cat picture on it. This part is critical because it puts you in the cat mood. Select the move brush and pull out a giant tumor. Mask the top and pull out an ear-shaped tumor. Trim and inflate to keep things flat on the front and puffy on the sides. Now we're getting somewhere. Remember to follow the reference material you painstakingly drew out. Use clay to build up to dig out some eye holes. Get up, up, and out of here with them eye holes. Perfect. Dig out a mouth and get working on that body. The body's easy because it's just a bunch of tubes. So start with a bunch of tubes. Line them up and weld them together. Select an edge, hold Q, left click, symmetry, topology. Now it mirrors your changes so you can half-ass the work. <laughs> Remember, if your geometry is symmetrical in any way, then you never have to full-ass again. Say what? It's all right, let's, fi let's fix up this face. First, I dump the Rick and Morty joke. Then I ask myself, 3D print guy, are you so lazy that you have to use the default shapes and pass them off as eyes, teeth, and tongues? Uh, yes. Make some wiggly wobbly worms and toss it out his face for some whiskers and brows. Now we need to make a terrifying freak out face for Gumball. Download a free head model that most resembles Nicolas Cage, then go to your Nicolas Cage folder that comes with every copy of Windows 10, and grab the most insane ones. Then grab your Gumball head, slice off the details, merge it with your Cage face, and Dynamesh. Then smooth out the edges. Sink in the cheeks with the move tool to make it skeletal and creepy. Use clay buildup and damn standard to make stretch out wrinkles all around the eyes to dial up the crazy, like an unhinged actor who's made some questionable life decisions. Add some eyebrows and teeth, and then Jesus f***ing Christ. It's perfect. Okay, I'm gonna teach you how to do facial animation real quick. So now I'm only an amateur animator, so if it looks a little weird, then it's because I suck. In fact, you should skip this. Better to learn from someone else. Thanks for watching, and as always, leave me a comment on. Nah, let's give it a shot. Okay, so facial animation is just transitioning from one mouth shape to another. Just take the original model and mash it into a new face. Let's make an E and O shape for Gumball. Move tool, lower the lips, stretch out the cheeks, E, and then move tool again to shape out an O. Then select all your heads, click on the original, and go to blend shape. Now you can animate from one expression to another. Blue blah blue blah blue 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 blah blue blue blue. blue. Now repeat this process 27,000 times in the next 10 hours because this freaking cat manages to have 2,000 expressions in the span of 5 seconds and it's 3 a.m. right now and I have like 42 blend shapes. Like, what the fuck? Well, kids, that's how you do basic facial animation. Add a voice track, add some color, add a background scene, and blammo. Silly face challenge! Lips monster! <laughs> Chin creature! <laughs> Bill <Belching> Chain challenge! <laughs> And here are the final models ready for printing. Want to download the files for free? Website. Also, I updated my Patreon to not be crap, so now it's got Discord, background models, rig characters, video tutorials, and special end credits for my supporters after every video. Patreon slash 3D Print Guy. Thanks for watching, and leave me a comment on what I should make next.